Hi, I'm Pankaj. I'm one of the directors of the Australian Institute of Advanced Studies. Today, I'm going to introduce you to uh, our Advanced Diploma of Engineering course. The Advanced Diploma of Engineering course, I would say, is probably the one of the best courses that's available for people who are looking for a pathway. Um, it is a course that's in demand in industry. Uh, all our students who graduated have been granted the post-study visa and on top of that they've all the ones who are interested have gone into uh, working with engineering companies they're working in um, predominantly in the engineering drafting offices initially so they're doing drafting of buildings structural designs and the engineering companies are, have been very pleased with our uh, students the skills that they go, go in with and all of these companies are more than happy to sponsor our students at the appropriate time. They've been looking for people like our students and there are not many around. In actual fact, um, with this COVID, um, Australia is talking a lot about bringing back more engineering back into Australia. This again is going to open up more amazing opportunities for students who study the Advanced Diploma Engineering with our college. I'm not going to go on much more than this. I'm going to introduce you to our uh, uh, some of our teachers in the Advanced Diploma of Engineering. They are Felipe, Victoria and Vahid. I'm going to leave it to them to explain to you a little bit more about the course. Thank you, Pankaj, for the introduction. In uh, Advanced Diploma of Engineering, uh, we focus on a wide uh, range of uh, units uh, for uh, based on theoretical and experimental uh, analysis in our units. Uh, for example, in my courses that I teach, I focus on thermodynamics, fluid mechanics, uh, which we start from the fundamentals, and then we uh, work on different uh, mm, like pipe piping components uh, in industry and HVAC engineering and uh, things like that which are really practical in real life uh, jobs that these will be integrated at the end with the uh, other courses uh, we offer for the uh, which we actually use those uh, knowledge in our uh, in, in a software uh, and uh, apart from that I teach uh, another course which is basically we focus on the statics and dynamics side of uh, the engineering, which, for example, we focus on a structural engineering, and we also uh, focus on different mechanical uh, components such as gears, bearings, clutches, and things like that. And as I mentioned, we then integrate that in a major project, uh, and we use different engineering software that uh, Victoria and Felipe will talk about in terms of like ve vertex an inventor uh, to uh, were to finalize that project and validate the results perfectly. Thank you, Vahid. So uh, my units are the basics. So I teach AutoCAD from the basics. So how to interpret a drawing, how to draw itself. And after that, the students go to uh, Philippe class, Philippe's classes with uh, 3D modeling and he will explain later. And also I teach manufacturing processes, material science, that it, it relates to how uh, products are made and the proper properties of these materials, which also relates to Vahid's units. And also in the fourth semester, we have a big project that um, includes all of these units. So AutoCAD 2D, Revit, Vertex, and some um, thermodynamics calculations and we put all of this together for all students to have the best experience here in the school for future jobs eventually. So I'll hand over to Felipe which will explain his units and also the, the last semester project. Thank you Victoria. So basically with all these skills of uh, maths and physics and to the drafting, um, what I teach is to how to 3D model parts and assemblies into mechanical uh, components. 
and um, using Autodesk Inventor and then in third semester what we do is that we also integrate manufacturing techniques and also um, stress analysis and dynamic simulation uh, along with Bahit's projects so the idea is that all his projects and my projects are um, mixed together and complemented and then in fourth semester we teach uh, Revit which is a beam tool which enables us to basically const to, be, to build a um, um, complete project using architectural and structural using vertex uh, HVAC electrical piping and plumbing into a single digital building and then we coordinate that project using project management tools and also Navis works and that basically uh, gives the student a final project that it's part of their portfolio that they can showcase it later for future jobs. Thank you so much Vahid, Victoria and Felipe. I hope you've got some insight into our engineering course. I'm very proud of our engineering course. I myself still teach in the engineering uh, area. Um, so would really love to see you and and planning for your great future using this course as a, as a launchpad. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.